You are watching ATVN Philippines. Emmanuel, the God with us so saves. Panem de Celi Prestitis Tiehis. Oremus, Deus qui nobis sub sacramento mirabili, passiones tuae memoriam reliquisti, tribu eque sumus, itanus corporis et sanguinis, tui sacra misteria venerari, ut redemptionis tuae fructum in nobis, ujiter sentiamus, qui vivis et reines, in saecula saeculorum. Blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man. Blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be His most sacred heart. Blessed be His most sacred heart. Blessed be His most precious blood. Blessed be His most precious blood. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Blessed be the Great Mother of God, Mary Most Holy. Blessed be the Great Mother of God, Mary Most Holy. Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph. Her most chaste spouse. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints.
we will uh, get ready for the Mass. We include among our intentions for this Holy Mass the thanksgiving of Patling Divine Mercy devotees, Divine Mercy Shrine, San Manuel, Mother Butler Mission Guild, Paniki Unit, Thanksgiving of Christina Pamintuan. Thanksgiving of Brother Raymond Fider. Thanksgiving, Mr. and Mrs. Rosendo and Juby Tabomo. Sister Febi Tiglau. Sister Presi Fider. Sister Eustachia Bustamante. Sister Marina Ibanez Angeles. Sister Vicky Taber Taberna. Sister Maxima Perez, Sister Juanita Tonelada, Mr. and Mrs. Benjamin and Rosalind Bukat, Thanksgiving of Divine Mercy Mission Capas, St. Pio Prayer Group Capas, Sacred Heart of Jesus Community Capas, Mr. and Mrs. Jerome de los Reyes and family, Brother Rome Lacino, Sister May Frias and family, Kagawa Derek Garcia and family, Miss Tec Tec Saluciano, Mrs. Perlita Gracia Bravo and family, Miss Blasilda Serrano, Brother Christian and Sister Carla Marie Corpus and family, Mr. and Mrs. Arvin, Ian Reina Jesus Gakutan and family, Congressman Noel Rivera, Mrs. Evelyn Rivera and family, Kagawad Nestor Sikat, Vice Mayor Alex Espinoza and family, Kagawad Ariel Batikan, Kagawad Jake Lopez, Kagawad Estela Manlupig, SK Chairman, Marlio de los Reyes, Sister Princesita Yusi and family, Mayor Roselia Rodriguez and family, Sister Lucia Viray, Sister Louisa Ong and family, Brother Mike and Sister pa Paula Jamse and family, Mr. and Mrs. Dennis Lugtu and family, Captain Edwin Macale, Rowell Elsa Ventura and family, Mr. and Mrs. Troy Evergard Canlas, Sidney Sam Morales, Donald Aguila, Hihinyo and Jennifer Morales, Blisilda Rivera Ong and family, Lucia Rivera, Randy and Joyce Manayang and family, Nestle Balignasay and family, Paul Alata, Belenci Tatanglao, Maria Teresa Lansangan, Christine Ann Corazon La Morena, Banji Perez, Harold and Milteza Pontecha and family, Governor Vic Yap, Brother Lloyd and Sister Julieta Medina, Brother John Supan and family. Holy Mass intentions for Ben Yalung M7 and ETVN family.
Ana Hilario and family, Virgilia and Euphrae Pinera and family, Roman and Tita Sadsad and family, Nitz Tamayo, Rick and Ned Uy and family, Arthur and Zeni, Sebastian and family, Jose and Lenny Tan and family, Bong and Normela Ang and family, Janet Uy C and family, Janine, Jensen and Jenny Uy and family, Dexter and Ellen C and family, Jopet and Estella C and family, Willie and Marlin Uy Ong and family, Nick and Zenny Uy Kana and family, Arnold and Ruby Uy Kana and family, Peter and Teresita Uy Lau and family, Wilton and Gloria Uy D and family, Tony and Lily Zialu and family, Benny and Beth de Guzman and family, Jose Pablo and Andrea David and family, Lori Ledesma and family, Cora Huet and family, Elmer and Marilette Dunca and family, Manalo and Angie Villanueva and family, Violet Bartolome and family, Vinco and Senya Trabil, Abe and Midi Paramio and family, Ray and Gloria Mercado and family, Chito and Linda Cabatic and family, Danny and Aleta Aquino and family, Aquino and Morales family, for blessing and healing, G. Mandy and family, Nelson, Nelson Ong and family, Belling Ang, Violeta Ang, Ponciano and Pat Patria Muro and family, Jasper and Ned Paras and family, Arlene and Remiso, Doctora Violeta Pineda, Doctor Randy Pineda, Lori Ledesma and family, Elmer and Marilette Dunca and family, prayer for healing. Healing for Maxima Aguila, Orlando Almiñana, Lourdes Almiñana, Joyce Manayang, Antonio Cruz, Ivy Masiklat, Grace Lansangan, Jeffrey Lansangan, Dennis Macale, Jessica Esguera, Speedy Recovery and Complete Healing for Adelina Suba, Purisi Makito, Nora Navarro, Elisa Caligagan, Jaime Aguilar Jr., Grace Lansangan, Jeffrey Lansangan, Dennis Macale. Special Intentions of Family Grito, Purification Santos, Chona Valdez, Victoria Vicente, Lisa Vicarte, Raymond Camposano. Also for Thanksgiving, Master Sergeant Humilde Mauro Jr. and family. Thanksgiving for her birthday, Sister Luz Alcantara. Thanksgiving. Let the soul stand.
In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Blessed be God who made us His holy temples and at our baptism. May His grace and peace be with you all. And with your spirit. Magandang hapon po sa inyong lahat. Well, brothers and sisters, we have the just prayed unceasingly no, before God, praying the very gift of the chaplet of the divine mercy, begging for mercy, compassion, blessing for graces. Ang gagaling po sa sacred and merciful heart of Jesus. Now, so that we may become worthy recipients of this mercy. God is good, but often we are not. At hindi tayo nagiging karapat-dapat sa kanyang mabuting, mapagpalang biyaya. Let us ask for His forgiveness. For the times we have behaved disrespectfully in our church, or received the Eucharist not properly disposed, Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. For the times we have failed to appreciate the sacredness of our persons, Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. For the times we have not respected the dignity and rights of our neighbor, Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. We also include the intention of the uh, 14 Ocampo Point families, our Tintong Mass, Sir and Mrs. Roger Tulu and family. The intentions of Joseph Juris Pineda. Also, prayers to the intention of Mr. and Mrs. Rick Auring Tabag. Thanksgiving, complete healing of Juris and Sister Sunny Incarnation. And Brother uh, Rolando Ro Rowena Manuel, Australia de los uh, Tabag. Also, in we include in our intentions the intention of uh, Rocky and Alice Sinisal of Joey and Tess Di Matula, and also Brother Fair and Ao Siron, and intention also of Imang Antonia Sison. And all your intentions, we lift them all up unto the Lord. O God, author of every mercy and of all goodness, who in fasting, prayer, and almsgiving have shown us a remedy for sin. Look graciously on this confession of our lowliness, that we who are bowed down by our conscience may always be lifted up by your mercy through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Ten Commandments enshrine values and duties which are valid not only for the Jews but also for all human beings and forever. The first reading. A reading from the book of Exodus. In those days, God delivered all these commandments. I, the Lord, am your God, who brought you out of the land of Egypt, that place of slavery. You shall not have other gods besides me. You shall not take the name of the Lord your God in vain. For the Lord will not leave unpunished the one who takes his name in vain. 
remember to keep holy the Sabbath day. Honor your father and your mother, that you may have a long life in the land which the Lord your God is giving you. You shall not kill. You shall not commit adultery. You shall not steal. You shall not bear false witness against your neighbor. You shall not covet your neighbor's house. You shall not covet your neighbor's wife, nor his male or female slave, nor his ox or ass, nor anything else that belongs to him. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Lord, you have the words of everlasting life. Lord, you have the words of everlasting life. The law of the Lord is perfect, refreshing the soul. The decree of the Lord is trustworthy, giving wisdom to the simple. Lord, you have the words of everlasting life. The precepts of the Lord are right, rejoicing the heart. The command of the Lord is clear, enlightening the eye. Lord, you have the words of everlasting life. The fear of the Lord is pure, enduring forever. The ordinances of the Lord is true, all of them just. Lord, you have the words of everlasting life. They are more precious than gold, than a heap of purest gold, sweeter also than syrup or honey from the comb. Lord, you have the words of everlasting life. Preaching a crucified Messiah has always seemed a vain enterprise, yet the fact remains that it is through the cross of Christ that the all-wise God has redeemed the world. Such is St. Paul's forceful reminder today, the second reading. A reading from the first letter of Paul to the Corinthians. Brothers and sisters, Jews demand signs and Greek look for wisdom, but we proclaim Christ crucified, a stumbling block to Jews and foolishness to Gentiles. But to those who are called Jews and Greeks alike, Christ is the power of God and wisdom of God. For the foolishness of God is wiser than human. Wisdom and the weakness of God is stronger than human strength. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Let us all stand. God so loved the world that he gave his only Son, so that everyone who believes in him might have eternal life. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. Glory to you, O Lord. Since the Passover of the Jews was near, Jesus went up to Jerusalem. And he found the temple area. In the temple area, those who sold oxen, sheep, and doves, as well as the money changers seated there. He made the whip 
out of cords and drove them all out of the temple area with the sheep and oxen and spilled the coins of these money changers and overturned their tables. And to those who sold doves, he said, Take this out of here and stop making my father's house a marketplace. His disciples recalled, they recalled the words of the scriptures, Zeal for your house will consume me. At this the Jews answered and said to him, What sign can you show us for doing this? Jesus answered and said to them, Destroy this temple, and in three days I will raise it up. The Jews said, This temple has been under construction for 46 years, and you will raise it up in three days? But Jesus was speaking about the temple of his body. Therefore, when he was raised from the dead, his disciples remembered that he had said this, and they came to believe the scripture and the word Jesus had spoken. While he was in Jerusalem for the feast of Passover, many began to believe the in his name, when they saw the signs he was doing. But Jesus would not trust himself to them because he knew them all and did not need anyone to testify about human nature. He himself understood it well. Sisters and brothers, the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Mauput, I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, on the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Gathered together in the house of God to celebrate the most sacred act of worship, let us present our petitions for the needs and intentions of all mankind as we say, Lord, make us holy. Lord, make us holy. That the people of God all over the world may always offer the Eucharistic sacrifice with undefiled hearts. Let us pray. Lord, make us holy. That all mankind may treasure the values enshrined in the Ten Commandments and live by them in perfect love for God and neighbor. Let us pray. Lord, make us holy. That the legislators may be guided by the wisdom of God's law in formulating the laws of every civil society. Let us pray. Lord, make us holy. That all human beings may be respected in their basic rights and never be subjected to humiliating treatment or conditions. Let us pray. Lord, make us holy. That all of us may treasure the sacredness of our own persons as well as that of others, and never defile it through sinful actions. Let us pray. Lord, make us holy. That those who risk their lives for the gospel in various parts of the world may inflame the church with their courage and missionary enthusiasm. Let us pray. Lord, make us holy. 
Uh, we also include the prayers of the Apoderado uh, family in our uh, Mass. And the souls of Pablo, Mariana Dominic, Jean Paul, Angel Patrick, Cirilo, Aurelia. And also the intention of Luzito and Alma Jambao. And uh, prayers too for the uh, intention of the Mandi family. And, uh, and the Uy Kana family. At lahat pa po uh, uh, ng kailangan ng ating panalangin. Lord of all holiness, you want to dwell in our hearts as in a most precious temple. Renew in us the awareness of your sanctifying presence. Cleanse us from all our impurities and reconsecrate us to your service forever and ever. Amen.
pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours might be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Be pleased, O Lord, with the sacrificial offerings. Grant that we who beseech pardon for our own sins may take care to forgive our neighbor through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Let Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation. Always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty, Eternal God, through Christ our Lord. For by your gracious gift, each year, your faithful await the sacred Paschal feast with the joy of minds made pure so that more eagerly intent on prayer, on the works of charity, participating in the mysteries by which they have been reborn, they may be led to the fullness of grace that you bestow on your sons and daughters. So with angels and archangels, with thrones and dominions, with all the hosts and powers of heaven, who sing the hymn of your glory, as without end we acclaim. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, this gift we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like a dewfall, so they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. The time he was betrayed, entered willingly into his passion, took bread and giving thanks, broke it, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice. Once more, giving thanks, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith.
Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partake of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world. Bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, the Order of Bishops, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy in us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Saint Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life, may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through Him and with Him and in Him, O God, Almighty Father, the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. At the Savior's command, form a divine teaching, we dare to pray. Deliver us, Lord, we pray from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days. By the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin, safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of a church, and graciously grant her peace and unity, in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Peace be with you. Peace be with you.
Beloved, behold Jesus, the divine mercy of the Father. Behold him who died so we may live. Happy are we who are invited to the banquet of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Amen.
let us pray. As we receive the pledge of things yet hidden in heaven, and are nourished while still on earth with the bread that comes from on high, we humbly entreat you, O Lord, that what is being brought about in us in mystery may come to true completion through Christ our Lord. Amen. Maupo lamang po tayo sandali. We include in our prayers in kaya Mr. Misalus Levi Arceo at ang mga iba pang panalangin. Una po ang ating pasasalamat sa inyong lahat sa pagdalo sa ating 100 chaplet na devotion at ganun din ang ating sabisa ngayong Sunday na ito. And this is Lent, so nagpapatuloy ang journey natin on preparation for the Paschal celebration ng Paschal Mystery. No? At ganun din eh, yeah, isang uh, pahagi ng uh, journey natin, yan, mga pagganap, ginaganap nyo natin, ang buong simbahan, no? mga pagdarasal, even mga retreat. So we have a retreat sa ano naman, uh, sa nine, meron po. If, uh, we, all, we are invited sa an open retreat. 1 to 5, no? Sa Sabado ata yun, yung March 9, no? 1 to 5 p.m., no? So, yun po, no? Then, ang isa pa na paalala natin sa inyo ay ang sa upcoming feast will be April 7, and we invite you, pagdating ng mga novena, ayan, gaganapin po dito, no? Every afternoon hanggang celebration ng feast. So feast day, uh, yeah, we have the, our masses and of course uh, confessions. It's a day na yon, and uh, so our masses and then confessions, and uh, will be. Uh, is a Facebook nando naman yung sa Divine Mercy, no? Uh, eh, ano na lang po niyo don? Ang isa ay uh, tignan po niyo yung mga announcements doon, no? At ikalawa, dun sa announcements about announcements ay at pag-share, eh, eto nagpapasalamat po tayo sa ETV and Network na eh, naririto po ang crew at ang kanilang producer si at director, si Brother Ben M7 Yalong. Ano? At yan dyan po siya at, at ang kasamahan and uh, help document itong ating pag-celebrate ng 100 Divine Mercy Chaplets. Kaya... Uh, keep them in your prayers, no? Salamat uh, sa kanila, okay? At uh, ganyan din ang mga nag-serve pala, no? Para hindi ko malimutan ang uh, our choir, ang ating mga commentators, lectors, Eucharistic ministers, offerers, our altar servers, no? At pati mga umawit din kanina sa ating uh, uh, benediction, no? At... Uh, Uh, lahat pa who prepared, who shared, at mga tumulong, pati sa pagkain, paghahanda, no? uh, para maging uh, at least matagumpay ang ating celebration. And uh, yeah, we have, uh, we'll be giving rosaries after, we'll be blessing them. At... Uh, uh, ako, hali kayo, ha? Yung holy water, ano? Lord, show us your mercy and love and grant us thy salvation. Verily, beloved, we pray to God, the mighty Father, that you may be transformed into the image of Christ, who vouchers will be so your rosaries as I aid in prayer and in living. May the Lord, in his love and mercy, bless the stokens of the devotions and piety. Ayan, so uh, may bigay na ninyo habang nag-a-announce ako. Para pagkatapos po, we'll be praying over you. Ah? At ayan, bigay nila. So, and uh, so, yeah, we'll make the announcements sa uh, Divine Mercy uh, Mission na uh, Facebook. No? At, uh, at eh, sa inyo rin pong lahat na dumalo, galing sa iba't ibang lugar at yung mga dumating din mula kaninang umaga ay uh, thank you everyone after the 
mash they will be uh, uh, praying over you and your intentions okay Okay, so yung uh, chaplet, no? uh, ang focus natin ngayong uh, anong ito, yung chaplet, ay uh, teach others about the chaplet, even your families. Huh? Have time to pray it even together. Pray it after the rosary. You have the rosary and then pray uh, the chaplet. No? That, will always, that will be a good uh, thing. Pero yung habili natin kanina, one, ayusin ho nyo yung altar nyo, ha? linisin nyo. Two, yung wala maglagay no and uh, and then of course pray huh? pray okay and pray with complete trust amen okay okay o meron na o, sige haba po binibigay we'll uh, give the final blessing pagkatapos we'll be uh, praying uh, uh, and uh, blessing you, no? And the anointing. Ayan po. Sige, tumayo po tayo, ha? Huh? The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Bow your heads and pray for God's blessing. Direct, O Lord, we pray, the hearts of your faithful. In your kindness, grant your servants this grace, that abiding in the love of you and their neighbor, they may fulfill the whole of your commands through Christ our Lord. Amen. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace to love and serve the Lord by observing His commandments. Thanks, Thanks be, be to, God. to God. Okay, so uh, bago po ako pumunta sa inyo, we'll be singing, of course, to the Holy Spirit. And uh, sa ating puso, alisin lahat ang galit, alisin lahat ang anumang dumi, kasi hindi mag-work, no? Sabi ko na sa inyo, ah, ay dito ang biyaya ng Diyos kung may bara at dumi ng kasalanan, no? Kaya... Sa puso nyo, eh, all things you remember na hindi tama, be sorry for them. Mga nakalimutan nyo, ask for God's forgiveness. At yung hindi mahanap, maaaring kumisay, nakalimutan, pero nagtatago pala dyan ng mga mali at galit. We will ask the Holy Spirit to search our hearts no? and purify our hearts that we may worthily receive ang blessing niya. 
Now Jesus is blessing us with his sacred blood. Trust him. At ang tiwala, kung ikay nahihirapan, gawin yun ang sabi natin, pray and pray a lot. Prayer, especially the chaplet, increases trust. Okay? So, may mga ipinagdadasal po kayo. Yung iba na rito, yung iba wala rito. Wherever they are, wherever they may be. Prayer knows no boundaries. Ipaabot natin pati ang blessing sa kanila. No? By lifting them up. And as we anoint you, you also pray for them. They will be receiving the blessing of the Lord. Okay? So, magdasal po tayo. Umawit. Come, Holy Spirit. Ang pag-awit twice praying, sabi. Kaya dito, we will sing, Come, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, I need you. Sigla 